Daniel Boudreau here from naturalmattressfinder.com. Today I'm going to give you uh, the main differences between the spindle organic hybrid latex mattress and the spindle all foam mattress. Now in front of me here I have the spindle organic hybrid mattress and you can see that the construction is made from three inches of Dunlop latex foam and below that is the six inch koi unit. Both these components are wrapped in their own covering. So you have the Dunlop here that's three inches and you have the six inch coil unit. Now this, the six inch coil unit, all the coils are individually wrapped and they're wrapped in a polyester type material. And they have a kind of cotton uh, encasement over that. So it's called a hybrid mattress because it's a hybrid between a spring coil unit and a natural latex foam layer. The advantages of a hybrid latex mattress is that they're mo it's more bouncy than an all foam mattress. If you like the traditional bounce of a spring mattress then you'll be more um, drawn towards this type of mattress. It's a little bit more breathable than an all foam mattress because you have this layer which is mostly, although it is six inches, its, its main volume is occupied by air. So if there's any uh, excess humidity or moisture, it will be dissipated through this layer and evaporate into the room. Uh, the other advantage is, is that the hybrid mattress can bear a little bit more weight than the all foam mattress. The spring coils will give continuous support under very heavy loads. Uh, whereas the all foam will have a maximum amount that it can be compressed and still guarantee breathability, uh, pressure relief and support. Another advantage of the hybrid mattress is that it is easier to move. So when you move the hybrid mattress, when you flip it over onto its side, you can lean it up against the wall. You can uh, move it up and down stairs. The hybrid mattress is just a lot easier to move. Whereas in an all foam mattress, it will bend and flop around and it's very, very hard to move. And you basically need to roll and fold it up, tie it up with a rope, or if you wanna move it without tying it up, you need at least four people to move it. The cons of a hybrid mattress are that they're generally not customizable. But in the case of the spindle organic hybrid mattress, it is customizable because you have the zippered cover here where you can have access to the inner components. So why would you need this? Because in the event that you're not fully comfortable on the medium firmness, then Spindle can work with you over the 365 day comfort guarantee period. Uh, and they will in some cases switch out this latex layer for one of a different firmness. Another con of the hybrid mattress is that you may have slightly more motion transfer than with an all foam mattress. But if you, the, with this mattress, for example, the individually wrapped coils will do an excellent job at keeping the motion localized and not transferring it to the other edge of the bed. But there will be a little tiny bit more motion transfer on this type of mattress that is a hybrid mattress as opposed to the all latex mattress. So I'm here with the spindle all foam mattress. This is the original spindle mattress. It's also a 10 inch, just like the organic hybrid mattress. But instead of the spring coil unit, which is six inches, it has two times three inches of Dunlop latex foam. I've already opened the zippered cover here. I'll show you the inside of the mattress. And it has three times three inches of Dunlop latex foam. And you can arrange these how you want. So the advantage of this mattress is that it's super customizable. Let's say I, I get this and as a default configuration, it's shipped with a firm, medium and medium. And if I want a slightly firmer mattress surface, all I do is switch the firm with the medium and then so it'll be medium, firm, medium. So that'll give me a slightly firmer feel for the mattress without even having to get in touch with spindle. I can just experiment with different configurations of the mattress in the comfort of my own home and that will give me a, a different firmness. So that's the advantage of the all um, latex mattress or the all foam mattress is that it's super customizable. 
The all foam version of the spindle mattress will have very good motion isolation. So when you're on one side of the bed, there is almost little or little to no motion transfer that goes to the other side. Now the motion transfer will be a bit less in the all foam version and when comparing to the hybrid. So in other words, the hybrid will transfer a slightly more motion, but it's not a huge difference. So if you're looking for the ultimate in motion isolation, the all foam version will perform a little better. Now something I didn't talk about when the hybrid version is the edge support. So one of the cons of the all foam mattress is that it will not have as much edge support as the hybrid mattress. So with the, the hybrid mattress, you'll have the coils which have a, a reinforced perimeter and with this mattress, it just has the foam. There's nothing different about it all the way till the edge. So if you're looking for the ultimate in edge support, this will not necessarily perform uh, as good as a hybrid mattress. One of the most important factors in deciding whether uh, you want to go with the all foam mattress or the hybrid mattress, it's that the all foam mattress is truly 100% natural. So you have a cotton cover that is quilted with the wool fiber, you have the three latex layers, and you have the same cover repeated on the bottom. And so in this type of mattress, there are no um, metal coils, which are obviously man-made, but the metal coils are encased in a polyester liner, polyester fabric, so that is also a synthetic product. So this is something to consider if you want to go for a truly 100% natural latex mattress without any uh, metal coils or any polyester liner that typically lines any uh, coil unit in any natural latex mattress. Some of the cons about an all foam mattress like the spindle is that they're heavier and they're harder to move in comparison to a hybrid latex mattress. So it, this mattress is quite heavy, but the other part that makes it uh, kind of a burden, it doesn't affect the sleep performance, is moving this mattress. This mattress is very hard to move. So if you're someone that's a college student or uh, you're, you're uh, renting or you're planning on moving frequently, um, I would not suggest this type of mattress just because it is very hard to move. Uh, if you want to pick it up, it's very hard to pick up because you see you can fold it over like that. And so if you're trying to carry it down some stairs, it will just flop around and bend. On top of that, it's very, very heavy. So that makes moving this um, very difficult. Now there is an easy way to move it. And what I figured out is that you can fold it in half. You fold it like that, this way, and then you'd wrap it with some rope all the way down. And that what that will do is you will be able to use the rope as a carrying handle. And that way, because the mattress is uh, a lot more compact, it will, it will keep its shape. So that's the, the only way I've found uh, is to a practical way to move this mattress without having to dis disassemble it. So here are the main points of why you would want to choose the hybrid versus the all foam mattress. So the hybrid with the uh, inner spring coils, the hybrid will have a little more bounce than the all foam mattress. So if you like the bounce, that is uh, something you can go for. If you have a tendency to overheat while sleeping, the hybrid will have a little better breathability than the all foam, but not an, an huge difference. So here are a couple of reasons why you might want to choose an all latex mattress like the one I have behind me here. That's the spindle 10 inch organic latex mattress. So this may be because you're unsure about which firmness to choose and you want to be able to customize the mattress at home. With a zippered cover here, you have access to the inner components. You can swap out the different layers, have a different configuration. And so that's how you can customize the firmness without having to order any extra components. And secondly, the 10 inch organic latex mattress by Spindle is an all natural mattress. So no synthetic components are in here. The only synthetic uh, component or material that's used is some nylon thread, that's, but that's very, very minimal. 
So thanks for watching this video. I hope I've helped you understand the main differences between the hybrid organic mattress by Spindle and the Spindle 10 inch latex mattress, this all foam mattress here. If you want to compare the Spindle mattresses with other natural latex mattresses, head on over to my website that's naturalmattressfinder.com and right there on the homepage you'll get access to a, an interactive comparison table. My name is Daniel Boudreau from naturalmattressfinder.com. I hope you have a fantastic sleep tonight and I will see you on the next video.